This is Marceline at Cashew Greens. Thank you for watching this video. And if this is the first time you come across to my gardening channel, please consider to subscribe below down there and hit the bell up there or there. And don't forget to open your notification icon so you can get notified on my next video. I upload advanced gardening video every week. So if you are following my channel, I don't want you guys to miss any of these gardening ideas that I will be sharing with you every week. So our exciting episode today is about how to make $50,000 a year growing lemons. So $50,000 a year is equivalent to Philippine peso, $2,614,775. That is my pre-calculation. Here's a quote. When life gives you lemon, what would you do? Make more lemonade, right? And then after you make all this lemonade, search someone whose life has been vodka and create a symbiotic relationship. And here you go. You have a blast party. It's a quote. Okay, guys. So this topic is so big. And unless you want to watch me, blah, 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 for two hours, I'm going to break this into a series of video. And there are three series. So the first series you will be learning on how to propagate uh, lemon seeds effectively using a systematic approach and then the second series would be propagating by cuttings and then the last series is the crunching number so that is the most important part in this video because it makes you jump excited and pump up and just like myself I always be excited every day and I want you guys to be excited and I want you guys to learn all of this because I'm going to share with you on that series video so don't uh, miss this series so before we continue this video one more thing if you like this video and would like to see more advanced gardening ideas please like share and subscribe now and don't forget to click the bell subscribing is totally I free grow mere lemon so we're going to specialize our plant to make 50,000 a year so we're going to grow from seeds and I'm going to show you guys on how to propagate seeds effectively using a systematic approach. But before we start uh, germinating the seeds, I'm going to give you a little bit information about the plant. This citrus is, was originated in China and back then it was just an ornamental plants because they're beautiful, they have a, a beautiful scent, it smells good, and then they grow them in the container. Now, in 1908, it was brought by agriculturists here in the United States, and then this plant becomes popular. They use this as the flavoring of the food or some other, uh, other ingredients that you can use from mirror. So that's why I created this video to share with you guys on how you can make money growing just mirror. So let's go ahead and join me to the table. Okay guys, I'm going to show you on this video on how to cut the lemon to get the seeds inside. Now we're not going to cut a lot of lemons on this video. I'm going I'm just going to share with you on how to prepare them. So this is one lemon. So the first thing you do is just to cut both in. Okay, so let's get started. So you cut both end of the lemon and then you cut this one in uh, four slice it's okay if you cut this seeds. it happens to me all the time so don't worry about it so cut in half and then cut it again okay now we're going to take out the seeds inside There's nothing in here. Empty. This is empty. So there's a small one. There's nothing in there. Now we're going to uh, soak this one in the water for eight hours. Now we're going 
to germinate this one faster, so we're removing the shell. So by soaking in the water, it helped the shell to soften. Now in nature, the, the use of the shell is to protect the seeds from early germination. So we're going to check the nature. There are only two products that I would highly recommend you guys to use, either you germinate seeds or propagate plants from cuttings. Use the GP or the root riot, and in the reason for that, they are against transplant shock. Once the plant is established, you can just plant them right away without moving the root system. So let's go ahead and uh, pro propagate our seeds in this GP. So what you need is to just put a hole in here, little bit like a quarter of an inch. You don't want to grow your seeds too deep. So here, and then you just put the seeds inside. So that's it. Now, uh, germinating the seeds, you can use either two systems. You can put them under the misting system or you can put them in the rain tower. And I'm going to show you on this video. There is a systematic approach to germinating seeds or propagating plants from cuttings. And I'm going to show you here on this video. I use this sprinkler and also the rain tower. So those are the methods that I propagate plants. And in the reason for that, the sprinkler is automated so you automate the delivering of water to the seedlings so there is no uh, dryness because the plants can take up water as needed as you can see here so i'm going to show you i purchased this uh, table this is a three tier and i just uh, separate them because i can see the uses of this uh, table plastic tear and you can just put the plants or the media here like what you see here on this video this is the uh, seeds of the lemon so i can just sit up in here and without the tray so that's how easy it is and then i'm going to show you in the rain tower so i will put this one here on this knit cut so let's go ahead go to the system there are two systems that we're using on this uh activity when we pro propagate our seeds lemon seeds now i we use the sprinkler system and also the rain tower now we can go uh, other methods when we go into propagating lemons from cuttings but at this time on this video we're using the system to germinate the lemon now here is the rain tower so the benefits of the rain tower is that when the water when the pump pushes the water to the top of the tower then in return the water trickles down creating a rainforest now there is uh, constantly delivering water to all the cells and then when the plants uh, create roots so the root system can take up oxygen there is no water lag because the water doesn't stay there it was just uh, continuously trickling trickling down so this is the best system i have a book on advanced gardening no space left behind that is a great book if i will put that book on the link of this video if you're interested uh, to use this system the book is precisely for people who have limited space like myself i have only 16 of an acre and in order for me to maximize my growing i use system to system so these are uh, the system that i included on that book actually there are seven growing system that i have written on that book so i again i will link that on this video so let's go ahead and put our lemon seed on this tower so this is the lemon seed and i put here in the net cup so what you need is just put in the tower like that so that's how easy it is This is our video for today and if you have question or concern, please leave comments below this video. I'll be there for you guys to answer all your questions. Let's go over the materials that we covered on this video, how to make 50000 a year growing lemons. Now we specialize the plant, so we are farming the mayor lemons. And you see me, I was filling the shell of these seeds to effectively germinate the, the seeds. But 
you would not be able to do this because you are going to germinate 250 seeds to come up to 150 plants to sell so there's no way you can do that but there's another method you can make them uh, germinate faster by soaking them in water eight hours to 24 hours this would allow the hard shell to become soft and it is easy for the germination to occur now the media so i highly recommend you guys to use the gp and also the road trial because this media may, uh, prevent against transplant shock so when the plant is developing and ready to transfer to the ground or the container you don't you don't have to go through with those transplanting so that's why i recommend you guys to use this kind of media now the system if you are germinating seeds or propagating plants from cutting you definitely need a good system so we use the sprinkler system and also the uh, rain tower on the next series which you will be learning on how to propagate plants from stem cuttings we are going to use the drip propagators and i will explain that to you on that video uh, next week so this is our video this is the first series and i hope this video would help you guys and good luck to your uh, citrus farming and if you can't leave a comment on this video you can also reach me on my site www.cashiergreens.com in that section i have let's talk so you can just chat me there and i will be there for you so again good luck and see you next week stay tuned bye bye